Hello, everyone. Hope you are doing really, really well. So let's talk about ChatGPT um, and what is all this buzz about. So um, ChatGPT4 is a great, great um, tool. You can call it as an intern. So what we've realized is the more specific information we give it, the more specific instructions you can tell it, it'll give you more accurate information. Do not rely on it completely though. You still need to check things. So it's not 100%. That's why I call it, I think this is like an intern who is not sure of things, but gives it a go, right? So let's just call it an intern who gives a, a go at everything. So I'm going to quickly share my screen with you. And there's one question that I get asked so many times, um, and you might have get gotten asked that as well, is, hey, do you have a sample employment contract that I can use? I generally obviously get it off the of the, the the business Victoria website and and then I'll say hey you can use this but get it checked like add your things but get it checked uh, by your commercial lawyer so that's generally what I say uh, once you've put all the information you can use chat GPT for that and it's quicker um, and you can add a few different things as well so for example here I'm just going to copy paste so create an employment contract, so call it a command or a prompt. Uh, for my permanent employee working 38 hours a week, we are a dental practice in Australia, add all leave entitlements, add a provision for working from home as well. You can add more details, you can add um, about bonus, add about um, anything else that you need to. So it'll generally then go and create um, like a contract. Again, it the more information, whatever whatever is specific that you want to give. If I hadn't added that leave provision because I tested it before, it was coming out without the leave, like it had leave entitlement, but it was like a one liner. But here it's actually laying out each and every um it each and every leave. And I think see how here it's assumed it's probably New South Wales. It's it's because long service leave is obviously different in every state. So it, so you want to double check whether which state you are in, uh, specific like this is specific to Australia. So it's got everything in there, but again, it's not hundred percent accurate. Um, what I would do in this situation is really copy paste, send it to the client, say, "Hey, this is what I've got for you." Amend, add, and then send it to your commercial lawyer for them to double check. So that that that's what I'm going to say to them. But this is a good. ChatGPT4 is a good tool, a go-to tool for if client asks you anything, they just assume that accountants know everything. Um, and then that way you can at least say, hey, you're not saying no as well. You can say, hey, I've got, I can, I've found this information for you, but I would suggest you to add, but also use a professional to double check it before you hand it over to your employee. So you're covering yourself, you're still responding to your client and that way you are happy, they are happy and we all are happy. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Thanks, bye-bye.